Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life to be that come. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave. And today I want to talk to you about how to open 1,000 doors by closing one. And here's what I mean. Most of us get a chance to connect with a few people throughout our life that we feel an intense physical, emotional, and spiritual connection with. And the challenge for many people is, many women specifically, is if you get a chance to connect with a man who is such a strong counterpart to you and who embodies all the qualities that you're looking for in someone, but it's not in a position to give you what you want, or you're incompatible for some reason, or the values that you share are not the same, and for some reason the relationship can't take place. If you follow the theory that many people follow, which is like there's one soulmate and that's it, then you get a chance to get stuck in that relationship and feel like you can't go forward because there's never going to be a time or a person that connects with you at that level of intensity. But I'm here to tell you that closing one door leads to a thousand more doors opening. Because if you get a chance to detach yourself from the length of time that the spiritual contract lasts, then you might find yourself in a world of possibilities in terms of someone who can fulfill those needs, but many other ones that this person couldn't. So what I'm here to tell you today, my message to you is so simple and so short. It's don't decide how long a spiritual contract has to be. Spiritual contracts can last sometimes forever. Sometimes they can last for many lifetimes. Sometimes they can last for a couple of months. So instead of you connecting with someone and feeling, oh my God, my heart is broken, this person broke my heart, thank that human being for whatever gifts they offer you and move forward. Move forward with a sense of clear faith that what you'll experience as a result of you connecting and fulfilling that spiritual contract with a human being is going to be something deeper, something that allows you to fulfill the next part of your journey and share a part of your heart that would have been impossible to share with this person. I hope this makes sense to you. If it does, please send an email to me and let me know. If you feel stuck in one of these relationships, also let me know. You can write a comment. If you're watching me on YouTube, you can like my video, subscribe to my channel, and head off to my blog where I share many more things on YouTube. And I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for allowing me to enter your heart and share this message with you. I think it's something that is seldomly talked about, but it's so necessary to understand. If the man you're with right now is a soulmate, but he's not the soulmate, then let him be, let him go and enjoy a thousand other doors that will open when you close this one. Thank you.